Hi and welcome to my channel. Today I'm going to make a bolognese sauce. So what do you need? Well, I have mushrooms, bacon, carrots, three tins of chopped tomatoes, a carton of tomato passata, mince, four onions, two white, two red, eight garlic cloves, four sticks of celery and I'm going to be also adding two tablespoons of sugar, two bay, bay leaves, four tablespoons of tomato puree and a tablespoon of mixed herbs. So let's get cooking. The first thing I'm going to do is to cook my mince in my air fryer. Now, as you can see, that's my mince now cooked in the air fryer. It took about 10 minutes, but keep an eye on it. Just keep stirring it every so often. And I want to transfer that now into my um, slow cooker. Next goes in my bacon. I'm doing this in a couple of batches. It doesn't matter if they're straight or not, because you're going to cut them, cut, cut them anyway. So in the air fryer, that goes. And I've sprayed it with a little, with a little of, um, light fray spray. As you can see, I've cooked my bacon and I've um, cut it into small pieces. I'm going to add that now into the slow cooker. As you can see, I've added the carrots, the celery, the onions, all chopped very finely into the slow cooker with the bacon and the mince. Next, we'll go in the tomato paste, the crushed garlic cloves, the mixed spot, the mixed herbs and then the tomatoes and the tomato passata so as you can see i've put the dried herbs the tomato paste and the crushed garlic in next will be the tomato tin tomatoes the tomato passata and then i'm going to cook, put it up on low for six hours and then i'm going to turn it up for on high for the last hour so i'll bring you back when i put the tomatoes and the passata in now I also added my mushrooms and two bay leaves and I'm going to add a dash of Worcester sauce and then I'm going to put it on and then I will bring it back when it's cooked and yes I did add the sugar I just forgot to tell you um, I'll bring it back when it's cooked oh and by the way don't forget to stir it up before you um, put the lid on and as you can see my bolognese sauce is done and I did some spaghetti and you can still see there's loads left in there I'm saying you can easily feed a family of six out of that or you can use it as a lasagna sauce and now I'm going to grate some parmesan cheese on top of that and there we go, the meal is done. Hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please give me a like. Please sub subscribe. Uh, please come and watch again. Please leave a comment. And until the next video, thanks for watching. Goodbye.